guys, welcome back to our channel. My name is Andrea. And I'm Howard. And we are with Foodimentary Adventures in Food. And we are here today with a snack box from Universal Yums. It is a monthly subscription service. And we've been getting this for, what is it, a year or two? Oh, uh, yeah, about a year, maybe. Yeah, and so each month they send you snacks from a different country and in the box of snacks, you get about seven to 10 snacks or so. Mm -hmm. And in the box, um, you get this guide for all the snacks that are in the box and you get tips and information on that country. And then you also get a description of all the different snacks in the box. And there's just a lot of fun facts and trivia about that country as well. Good. So, and we like it a lot. So we are going to jump in with the very first snack of the box. And by the way, I forgot to mention, their snack box is $25 a month. And so, how it is opening up the first snack, which is called um, Kim's Snack, snack chips. chips. And they are potato snack with assorted spices. Okay. Ooh. They kind of have a pop chips texture, kind of light and, and I don't like pop chips. It's not bad. It's not bad. I like it. It has like a peppery taste or a paprika or something. Something like that. It has kind of a tang to it. Yeah, but it's not bad. It's not bad at all. It has a good flavor. And I will say I don't like pop chips, but these really don't have the texture of pop chips. They're more, they're harder like a potato chip. Yes. They're pretty good. Okay, what's next? Okay, next up is... It is milk chocolate with salted caramel crispies. And I like, um, what are those, crunch bars? Do you eat those? Crunch bars? Nestle's crunch bars with the crisp rice in it. Oh, yeah, I don't mind those. So I think this is what these are gonna taste oh, like. It says... a little different. Let me see. Oh, it does look a little bit different. It says salty and sweet crispies. You'll feel like you're floating on fluffy cocoa clouds. Ooh. Basking in the warm caramel sun. So once I cut it, that's what it looks like in the middle there. Mm -hmm. Have a piece. Okay. Does they look like? Cheers. Mm, I feel the salt. Mm-hmm. And caramel. Mm-hmm. It's not bad. So I don't know if I like all this salted caramel stuff that's going on these days. I don't either. But you need to dial down the salt a little bit, but it's not bad. It's really not bad. And I like the chocolate in that bar better than in a Nestle's bar, because I felt like it was creamier. Yeah. And I definitely did taste the caramel. It's good chocolate. It is really good chocolate. Okay, so the next thing that we are trying... is something I probably won't like. And I won't either. It is a salty licorice bar, and I am not a huge licorice person. I don't like licorice. And especially black licorice. And so they say locals refer to this as black gold. No. Um, it was... Mu sorry, it was once used as a medicine to clear stuffy sinuses. <laughs> They're not selling it for me. <laughs> They're not selling it for me either. Oh, I hate black All right, licorice. I'll, I'll try and take one for the team here. Tell me for a the... tiny, tiny piece. Oh my gosh. Oh, this, I don't know if I can, oh, I did kind of cut it. Oh man. But. Oh, I hate black licorice. I hate. All right, I'll give you, uh, I'll tore off a little piece. Oh, you're the best. I'll, I'll try a even smaller piece. <laughs> 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 no, I'll, I'll, I'll take a, I'll you're take You're gonna take a, that big piece? I'll take a bigger piece. Okay. Cheers. Cheers. All right. I really don't like it. Oh, um, oh. No. That's awful. It doesn't taste as licorice as I. Yes, it does. This All is right. black licorice. This is bad. I don't want the rest of mine. Um, we'll throw that one away. Yeah, we're not. It's that bad. It is that bad. It is that bad. Let's okay, something else to get over it. Okay, so oh. the next thing is oat cookies with cocoa filling. Um, I still haven't swallowed y'all. I, it's I stuck can't. in my mouth. <laughs> oh man. Let's try eating something else. 
So it says this woman in Denmark opened up this bakery in 1864 and she started baking these cookies and now they're basically part of the household name. Oh, there. Um, oh my gosh. So they've been making these cookies for 150 years. Crispy chocolate filled cookies. Oh, this looks like something I've seen before. You know what, it does. I've had, I think you have, are those two stuck together? I thought it was one. I think it's one. Okay, so look on the picture on the. It's one. You want a whole one? Or you oh know? no! I just need something to take that taste away. I, I still have not swallowed the licorice. Which piece would you like? The big one. Okay. Uh, we hope this takes away cheers. licorice. Not bad. So it's a crunchy cookie right there. And on the inside, chocolate. Ch chocolate. Mm. To me, the chocolate's not as good as the one on the candy bar. Yeah, but take away take the licorice. Too. It does take away that. That's the only way I was able to swallow that licorice. Oh man, that was awful. Well, these well, cookies aren't bad. Would yeah, I, I like buy them. them? I don't know if I'd buy them. I'm mm. not big on chocolate, but um, I like that. Okay. Let's take my mouth. Mm. Hey. Okay, so the next thing that we are going to try um, are these. It says. Kim's American Grill. These are potato chips with grill seasoning. Grill seasoning. Yes, and it has onion, tomato, paprika, chili pepper. Oh. It's like potato chip. And this looks like a Ruffles. Ruffles had ridges. Cheers. Tastes like regular potato chips. Mm-hmm, but they're salty. Yeah, very salty. Very salty, but they do have a, they actually do taste like a barbecue to me. Are they smokier than um, a barbecue chip that you would get here in the U.S.? They don't I have the sweet, uh, sweetness of the barbecue. That's what it is. It doesn't have the sweetness. It's just all smoky. Actually, I prefer that to like a Lay's barbecue potato chip or something like that. Okay. Next thing. Um, these are raspberry gummies. And I like gummy bears. Uh, I don't really need gummy bears, but it doesn't do anything for me. But I love them. Oh, it looks like a little ghost thing from uh, Miss Batman or whatever. Oh, it does. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, this is what it looks like. Mm -hmm. Cheers. Cheers. Oh, it's salty. It's sour. You're not salty. Not what I expected. Mmm. Well, it got sweeter at the end. Yeah, but it, you still didn't get out salt. Initially, I got salt. And then, initially, I got sour. No. Oh. But it doesn't taste like, if you like the hair bro gummy bears, they don't taste like that. They're like very soft and cloudy, like poofy. It, it got sweet, which is good. At the end, it was fine. But the yeah. beginning taste, I would say no, but the. Yeah, it doesn't have the chew of a regular gummy bear, it's softer. Oh, so you say, I, I understand what you say. It's not, yeah. The texture is different. The texture is different. But, okay. okay. Anyway, next thing up are cheesy corn puffs. Okay, corn puffs. Um, let me see here. This looks like something you would like. You think? Yeah, corn puffs. Ooh, because I do like um, Cheetos oh. cheese puffs. Mm -hmm. Cheers. That one tastes like a cheese puff. I like a cheese puff. I really like. No. I don't mind it. No. I didn't, no. I don't. Tastes good to me. It does not taste like a cheese puff. It tastes like a stale cheese puff. Oh, it's not crunchy, that's why. It's I not crunchy, mm. it tastes stale. Like you open it and you forgot about it and you put it in the pantry, <laughs> but a few months later you came back to it and remembered, that's what it tastes like. I'll eat it. <laughs> Knock yourself out. So right. the next thing. Looks like the same as the first one, but different flavor. Yes, it says puff pastry with cream filling. Oh, it's just pastry this time. No one was like a cookie. Mm hmm And in case you're wondering what I'm doing, I think I mentioned this, but there's a description of all the products in these little booklets, so I'm just trying to read what things are. Oh. Oh. This, one, oh, this one's a little broken. Let me try and find one that's not broken. Oh, they're all they're kind of all broken. broken. 
So this is the broken side, and this is what it's supposed to look like. And see, it's a sandwich cookie. I don't know if you guys could see that. Yeah. It looks like some kind of vanilla cream. Oh, it is, it's vanilla. Okay, you want your own cookie? No. <laughs> you want to share my cookie? Yes. Okay. Mm. Let's Mm -mm. It's good. Mm -mm. I like it. The cream is very, very sweet and gritty. Sweet is good. And the, the thing, the, the uh, pastry part was kind of sugary. Oh yeah, I like it. I don't like that. It's not even, so it's not like a cookie cookie texture. It's like a... It reminds me of something that I don't know like what. Like a churro texture. Oh, you know what it is? You know those elephant ear stuff I like? Yes. That's what it. That's nah, what it's that's what like. I like. I the don't the like texture it. of the um, of the pastry is that elephant ears pastry stuff, mm -hmm. which I like. And I don't like that. Okay, so next up we have tasty potato sticks, sour cream, and onion, and that sounds good to me. Okay, sour cream. And oh, your very small sticks. Very small potato sticks. I think we have something like that here in the U.S. and the I can't Andy remember. Cap thing. Yeah, but Andy caps are bigger. Mm. Cheers. It's good. I like it. That's a good flavor. You may need to uh, pop a few in there to get a good yeah, taste. Yeah, you can't just eat one. You probably have to eat like ten. <laughs> okay, next up we have milk chocolate with strawberries and caramel. Oh. And you don't like strawberry, really. No, but um, I'll eat it. <laughs> oh, it's actually individual ones in there. I mean, there's a few of these, whatever. That's my upside down or not. Oh, no. yeah. Yeah, no, you did have it upside oh, down. Oh, yes. It's a skull and crossbones type oh, thing. Oh, I did not notice that before. Yes. Let me cut it. See if it has something in the middle or something. It's called, um, it's it's a traditional festival that happens there called Midsummer. Or looks, Midsummer, I don't know if I'm saying that right. Looks like it has something in the middle. It's a strawberry. Okay. <laughs> okay. Cheers. It's good. You like it? Chocolate's very good. The chocolate is very good. And the, um, Strawberry stuff is not overpowering at all. I, I like it. I don't really, I mean, the strawberry does have a good flavor, but I'm not a big fan of filled chocolates. I don't mind them. But that chocolate is delicious. Mm. That is really good. It's good chocolate. Creamy, mm, okay. So the last thing that we have in the Yum Box is a Yum Bag. So you wanna try one? You wanna try this one, the cookie dough one? So every single month they send you kind of like penny candy in a bag, little popular candies that are so they have different in that country. Here. So they have a gingerbread toffee. So the oh, gingerbread, gingerbread toffee, toffee, toffee is right there. And then they have a cookie dough praline, cookie which is right praline. there. And then the last one is, um, it's a bubblegum toffee. And it says it's a fizzy toffee. <laughs> yeah, so we're not gonna try all of them. We're just gonna try one of them. You want to try the cookie dough praline? I mean, yeah. It says chocolate filled with cookie dough. Oh. Sounds good. See if I can cut it. That's not what I thought it was going to be. Because I don't normally like cookie dough ice cream and stuff like that. It's hard to cut a wall. Oh. Well, that's okay. So it's filled with stuff. <laughs> that's a very good description. <laughs> Cheers. Mm. I like it. You do? Mm-hmm. Tastes like gingerbread. Mm -mm. Like the inside? Cookie dough. Gingerbread um, cookie dough. <laughs> Not chocolate chip cookie dough. <laughs> it's like a gingerbread cookie dough. No, that's good. And that, I think that's it. We're, we're done. Yeah, so that is everything in our Universal Yums box. We hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And we will see you guys next time. Bye. Bye.